Attention citizens, nuclear strike imminent. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Fallout 76 Atomic Shop review on the channel. If you enjoy, hit the like button, you know exactly what to do. And of course, guys, if you are new, don't forget to subscribe. That'd be lovely. We just hit 23,000 last night on stream, so that is absolutely lovely. So thank you everyone that has subscribed and supports the channel. Now let's dive straight into it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have got... Oh my... Oh my god, this is actually a really good week. For a lot of people, this is a good week. We finally have the last remaining data, data mined items, which I've seen in the files. Um, so when I looked through all the saved images I had, the only things I didn't see was the Hellcat flags. Now, we've got here, in a bundle, we've got the Hellcat Mercenary Field Gear, Mercenary Berea, Flag, Flag, Icon, Frame, and the Screaming Eagle skin is actually in there as well. So they've actually re-brought out the Screaming Eagle skin for the handmaid and added it to this bundle. Now, originally, the Screaming Eagle skin, if I'm not wrong, was from a season. Was it the Screaming Eagle one that was from a season? I've got a feeling it was, but I can't remember if it was the first one they brought out or if it was from the season. If it's from the season, that's exciting. But if it's not, then fair, like it doesn't mean as much. But if it's from a season, it's quite exciting because that could mean, you know, glass walls could get added at some point, hopefully. But, yeah, 1,200, not uh, the most amazing thing in the world. You get some flags, you get an outfit, um, and you get the icon and the weapon skin. Now, the weapon skin, like I've been saying for a couple of weeks now, we need more of these. So Bethesda... Get yourselves on making some weapon skins for all the popular weapons and just upload them for like 200 atom each, 250 atom. People will buy them. You'll make a load of money, I promise you. And then, you know, I'll not even take a commission. I promise. <laughs> Going on to the other ones, we've got a warning sign set for 300 there. Not too shabby. Uh, we've also got the concrete defences, which is pretty decent as well. I don't know how much they are, though. Let me know in the comments if you can see. And that's the Screaming Eagle skin right there. Really good. It is for the handmade, as you can see. And it makes your handmade actually look like a decent weapon. It looks, makes it look like an M16 carbine type of uh, gun, which probably in real life is called something different. But on Call of Duties and stuff, it looked like that. Um, but yeah, that's the first page there. Atomic Seals, we've got a lot of stuff that was available like last week. I think this is literally the same as last week's. We've got the Greylock Villain Bundle, which someone said I didn't show off, I think, last week. So that's that there. In fact, I did show that one off. It was another one. Uh, Black Combat Dagger, Dancer, Red and White Lights, Responders Workbench, which I actually did buy. Uh, Caravan Trader Outfit, which is actually a decent outfit. I do like that. Um, US Army Paint. I've actually got some free icons in utility as well flashing at me. Uh, bomba, uh, bombat, <laughs> bom Bomber Jacket Bundle we've got available as well. Going on to the Greatest Hits, we've got the Log Cabin Bundle, which is the... Is that the Prefab one or is it the Walls? Log Cabin. It's the Prefab, which I actually said a few weeks back. I haven't seen anyone use this in a while, and someone did a camp for it. So that came back in. But look at the price of this, right? 1500 You get the Fire Pit, which is that. You get the ice box, which is that uh, wooden box over there. You get a vintage wallpaper, which is, I'm going to presume that. You get porcelain wallpaper, which is these two. You also get a weathered wood wallpaper, which is that one. And you get the rustic watermill, which is an awesome cam item as well, which Cova's just done a video with, and it looks sick. Um, but 1500 compare the price of this one compared to the other one, this is a lot better price for your money. So, pretty solid bundle. I don't actually own any of these, so I might, I might actually buy that bundle, you know. They've changed this a bit and added some more stuff in, I think. I can't remember some of this stuff being in this bundle in the past, but yeah, that's not too bad. There's also Responders Bundle for 1800 You get the workbenches. Uh, held on a minute. I own... It hasn't given me a discount, even though I own some of the items. That's a bit weird. Uh, you actually get the responders tent as well. And uh, no, you don't. No, you don't. I said this in the past, and you don't get it. Um, no, you do not get the responders tent. I said this in the past because I seen the picture of it in an old review, and I was wrong. So you get the power armor, you get the pit boy, the backpack, uh, wall decorations. There, they're pretty cool. Uh, icon and flags. You also get the rust scabber bundle, the Raider scabber bundle. Can't get my words out today. A few outfits and stuff in there. Is that actually a handmade skin? Do, 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 do. Tire backpack, handmade rifle. Yeah, the scab of paint, which is actually pretty sick. Oh, why don't they sell that by itself? That'd be awesome. 
Um, we've also got the Voltec bundle down here as well, which is a few bits and bobs there. Not too shabby. I did used to own that thing on PlayStation. Going in the Voltas section, we've got the Raider Waster bundle, which is some power armor there. Uh, tire backpack, waster paint, gold 50 caliber machine gun paint. Is it just me or is this week got a lot of skins in? Bethesda, are you actually listening to me? If you are, sorry for all of the abuse, you know, it's just got to be done. I'm sorry, you know, I don't mean it in a nasty way. I love the game. I want it to do well. I want it to do very well because, you know, I love it. And I've been playing it for three years now and I just need to see some changes like the rest of us. But yeah, this is that pretty decent bundle, as you can see. 1800 could be a bit arguably steep, but it does have a power armor in there, so that's why it's so expensive. We've got the Survivalist Free States bundle, 1800 as well, Jesus. A long list of items in there, more power armor, uh, a few bits and bobs. I do love that outfit there. And is that gonna work? it's got a weapon skin in as well. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, guys. Bloody hell. All right, we've also got the Catwalk bundle set as well, which is awesome. If you haven't got that, this is something that's very helpful for you uh, if you're a camp builder. You can do a lot of cool glitches with that, including like setting out your foundations and stuff like that. So very helpful if you don't have it. Mothman Furniture set for 700, you get the bed. This is a really solid week. They've added a lot of in lot and lot of stuff in this week. Can't get my words out again. Mothman bundle is pretty half decent though. You get quite a few bits and bobs in there, and it's only 700. Like. Look at this bundle, 700, right? Not even on sale. And you get all these camp items. You get like a bed, a chair, the old uh, ceiling light, side table, and desk lamp. You get more in this bundle for 700 than that new bundle. So, you know, bargains. This is 720. It's actually 1200. It's a gasoline red rocket diesel fusion. Uh, it's not really. It's a red rocket mega furniture bundle. And this is a pretty, one, pretty decent one as well. You get like the bar stools and stuff, bar set and everything like that. I'm not going to be buying it because I already own a lot of the items, but yeah, it's there if anyone needs it. And on the final page, we have got the American Eagle um, icon there. We've also got some free perfect bubblegum. Suit Mutant Outfit is up for sale for 490 if you're interested in that. And of course, the beautiful Open Office filing cabinet is still there. If you've got Fallout first, as well as the Fallout first uh, quarterly catch-up, which has been available for... A long time now and it still says new there's also the hair power armor skin which is pretty sick as well so not too bad but that's the atomic shop for this week guys i hope you did enjoy if you did hit the like button subscribe that'd be lovely and yeah drop a comment down below just to blow up the algorithm write down in the description uh, in the comments what you think dtd stands for or what you think the funniest dtd would stand for because in the discord it's a little running joke so if you can come up with some funny thing for the meaning of DDD, I'll pin it in the top comment. Why not? Anyways, thanks for watching. See you later, guys. Bye-bye. Attention, citizens. Nuclear strike imminent.